Good morning, YouTubers. While my eggs are cooking, I shouldn't be multitasking, but time is time is precious. And I garbage picked this the other day and aired it up, and it's still holding air nice, tight, and solid. And it's a lot of good rubber there that'll fit my bike. I think I'm going to salvage a reflector too, because that's that should just be screwed on there. It looks like screwed on there or stuck on with a couple. Couple little tabs here you squeeze together, it'll come off your spokes. Should come off your spokes. I gotta poke it out of there, I'm not sure. There we go. Oh, almost. Come on, get out of there, you bastard. What the heck? Can you figure it out, Michelle? Mm, that don't want, I thought it would pop off. They used to screw these things on here. That's the expedient way. Now I gotta figure out figure out how that goes. If I was a real cheap bastard, I'd take the cone and the bearings out. Those cost some money, and if you ride a bike, you a lot you wear them out. First step is to get the air out of the tire. And I don't have my valve unscrew, so I use the I use these things. A deflating experience. I would say the air's out. You can almost get these off with your fingers here. You break the bead all the way around, loosen it up. And you can use, you don't want something sharp because you don't want to poke a hole in that good inner tube. But if you just get something under here and start prying up, Okay, you got it. You got it held up there. I got a butter knife. I'm going to use on my toast. As I say, you don't want a sharp object in there. And just go all the way around the rim. For those of you that don't know how to change a bike tire or inner tube, I'm taking this off because I'm going to make a run to the scrap here and I'm going to add this metal to the scrap pile. I'm going to have to check on my omelet pretty soon. So you want, that's an expensive part. You want that tube out of there. You got to push the, you got to push the valve back through there to get that out. All right, you got the tube out. That gives you more room to work with your fingers. You gotta pry this over the up, the same side as the other one came out. There we have it disassembled. I did notice one thing. It's a few years old. It's got some age cracks here in the in the rubber, but the, the tube holds the air, so that doesn't concern me. What concerns me is how my my eggs are doing over here. 
if I can flip them without destroying them. Oh, that's fluffy. When you, when you beat the eggs up with some water or coffee, whatever you put in them, it makes them extra fluffy. And I don't think I can turn this without smashing it, but I'm not a perfectionist. Yeah. So I'll turn it piece by piece, step by step, inch by inch. Piece by piece, slowly I flip. Yeah, I should have just was messing with the bike tire a little bit instead of a little, little carbonaceous flavor. So I'm going to shut the pan off, the heat off. And cheese it! done and I'm going to butter it with the same knife I used to take the tire apart there's the bagel and the tire changing knife peace out